buddies. <laughs> I've had a couple of you ask me if I, I would make y'all some homemade chili. So today's your lucky day. Now, let me take you over here and I'm going to show you what I'm doing, okay? See here, I've got my hamburger made on. And while I'm doing that, I'm sauteing them green peppers and onions with that. Now, it depends. I can't tell you how many green peppers and onion to put in that because it's to each its own, you know. If you don't like green peppers, don't put them. If you like onions, put more or whatever, you know, it's to each its own. Now, I'm going to let this simmer and, and get tender, and uh, and I'm going to drain. If there's any, a lot of oil, you know, I'm going to drain that off, okay? All right, I'm going to let this finish cooking, and I'll be back, right back, okay? Hang on. Okay, honey, I've got everything wilted down and drained off and everything. Now, this is the next step. What I'm going to do is this. Hang on. I always add my chili mix on the dry ingredients. The reason I do that is because it releases everything in these chilies, okay? I'm gonna add two packs to be cooked. Now, if you're not fixing this big a cooker, I'm gonna add one. You know. I'm gonna give this a good mix of stir and get some pot Okay, let's stir that around a little bit. Now, I'm gonna add me a little onion powder. Just do it till you think it's right. I'm gonna add me some diced tomatoes. Oh, it smells so good in here. You know you can't go wrong with onions and green peas. These are the um, rotels. Now you can use the hot, the mild, the Mexican, whatever. It's whatever you like. Now, I'm uh, putting pinto beans. You can put the red beans, the northern homemade soup beans. Stir this around a little bit. Now, now and after I got that stirred around, I'm gonna add my big can of tomato juice. Now I'm gonna taste something else too. If you like your chili hot, this is when you need to add like your um, hot spices to it, you know, pepper flakes or that hot mix and all that stuff. Now, I don't like hot food at all. None. So, you do what you have to do on that part. Some people like it. I not. For me, no, I, I don't. I really don't. But I'm going to put a lid on this and I'm going to turn it probably on down medium low. And it's better if it simmers for a while, okay? This isn't hard uh, to make it out. Uh, Y'all wanna see it? Hold on, hang on. Now, right here it is. See? Now you can also, if you don't have tomato juice, you can mix up the tomato paste and water like, you know, direct it on the can and use it. Or if you just wanna use completely the uh, tomatoes, you can. Some people don't like a lot of juice. It's whatever. But guys, that's how I make my chili. And I'm gonna taste something, it's really good too. Simpler the better to me. <laughs> all right, guys, I'm gonna turn this down and I'm gonna clean up this mess and make you all some chili tonight. I love you all, bye.